Hello guys, it's time for a new video, a new adventure again. I have four races in total and uh, one surf event that I'm working in. Working into so there's lots of happening during the next month. I'm leaving the day after tomorrow. I'm doing it in English now because I was talking with my foreign friends and they told me that yeah the videos are nice and it's nice to look at them but uh, the problem is that we can't understand anything so that's the reason why I'm doing it in English from now on or at least trying it's I think it's good for me too to like how to say uh, can't find the word well anyhow it's good for my language my English to get better at the same time so it's a win-win situation I think and I have like probably 26 subscribers at the moment so I think that they will they won't matter if I change my language from Finnish to English it's time to get to packing I hope I remember everything Here I am at the Beijing airport at the moment and I'm feeling pretty tired. I didn't get any sleep on a plane from Finland to China and, and for me it's like like 5 a.m. or 5 in the morning in, in Finland, 9 a.m., 10 a.m. Here, here, uh, here in China so I have quite a long day ahead of me still so we'll see how it goes. But the main point is that I made it here through all the security checks. I was pretty scared how they like about my all my camera gear and all the batteries that I had with me. But uh, I just had to show them. But uh, they didn't take any any stuff away. So that was that was a good thing. But yeah, now I go and grab a cup of coffee and wait for the last flight. We'll see what happens next. And I made it here to the destination. I'll say one more flight for today and I'll be dead for sure. So, all good. The last mission for today is to find my uh, driver. I just received a message uh, that they don't speak any English and they did not have any sign whatsoever saying my name so we'll see what happens nothing yet they told me that uh, wait for someone to recognize you so eventually found the guy I walked past him like maybe four times but uh, yeah he was there at least the uh, the worst traveling part is over now, so... Wow, I thought that my my wife is a speed walker, but this guy definitely beats her. But yeah, I think this area, or at least what it seems, there ain't much Western people around here because I'm like the weirdo. <laughs> I'm like the weirdo in here, but uh, it's 29 degrees. It's perfect weather. Can't Wait to get to the race. Yeah. Uh, it feels good. It really feels good now. Apparently, we're picking up someone from the uh, from the train station too. This is pretty funny because the driver doesn't speak English at all and. I was just taking some video with my camera of the trains and stuff over there and then there was this police officer who who saw me who saw me 
taking pictures with my camera through uh, from the from the car and now he was walking around the car taking pictures of the plates and stuff like that so I don't know if this looks suspicious or something but uh let's hope I won't get too much misunderstood here <laughs> oh yeah this is so funny now we got the rest of the people inside the car and I hope that now we're taking off to the train station. Nihao. Nihao. Nico. Hello, Han. 